Now we know digital LSAT, LSAT flex regardless, it's going to be reading on a screen. So you want to do as much of your prep on screen as possible, getting used to reading that difficult dense text on the screen. Try to do the prep tests online instead of out of the books if you can, because it is a okay. little bit different. The okay. other thing is some different exercises and drills you could play around with. Do you feel like when you read a passage, you're able to walk away with the main idea? Some, it, main idea, always. I can always Good. catch it because I've, I've realized that it's, the, it's whatever the author's try, like the author's, like when the author comes out, I've realized it's a big deal, whether it's their, um, their view, their opinion, you know, if it's positive, it's negative. I'm, I'm very good with the main point questions. I'm very bad with the, so like the global questions, the global questions are good. Um, I'm very bad with the like specific questions. I, I don't know how to explain it. Like the, the detail or into ones. Yes. Like, what did this mean? I, I get a little like, you know, like, Oh, like what in this passage did they mean by, by saying this word? And then it's like, I'm having trouble you know, I, I second guess myself a lot. Yeah. Okay. So in that case, what you might want to do is after you read the passage, of course, you knock out those global main idea questions. Then for the detail oriented questions, you could, as a drill on your own, prephrase or predict the correct answer without looking at the choices whenever possible. So cover up the choices, maybe with a post-it if you're doing it out of a book, otherwise just do it on your scratch paper, cover it up with your hand in some way and just write out your own prediction of what the correct answer would be. And then see later if you can match it up with the correct answer. Obviously your phrasing and articulation will be simpler than LSAC's, but you can get a sense of whether you're on the right track or not. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.